Hi everyone and business minded people. Welcome to my channel. My name is Kenna and this is Kenna's channel where we talk about business idea, online ideas that you can start to make an extra cash. So today we're going to discuss about top online business in Kenya 2021 that you can start. Uh, what you will need is a social media page. Of course, it's one it's one of the things that you, it's free to start and you don't need any requirements. Scratch that. The, it's free to open a social media account. The only cost that you're going to occur is the internet and time. So you're going to have um, a business account in either IG, Twitter, or Facebook. So our first one is online grocery store. Um, the first thing that you're going to do is open an online store where people can order on can order online, and you're going to deliver what they have ordered for. Then you're going to research on the vendor and the local supplier of the local produce uh, to supply fresh produce. Uh, then the second one, uh, the, sorry, the third one is include a delivery fee. The cost of transport from wherever to your client's place. Then the second uh, business idea that you can do online is baking. Um, what kind of baking are you going to do? Are you going to bake cakes, naked cakes, soft with soft icing or fondants? Or are you going to bake croissants or cinnamon rolls or etc, etc? So one of the things that you're going to have is either uh, you learn how to bake or go to or you have an inbuilt skill that you're passionate about baking. The third business idea that you can do online is catering. It's one of the booming business in Kenya and you can cook for people who have 8 to 5 and don't have time to cook for themselves. Uh, in other words, you can say bachelors. Um, so here it's when the customer order online and they, they can call or just text you and and then prep, cook and deliver. Not that you have to have a menu, either a daily one or a weekly one. You can also buy cereals, package them, then freeze them and sell them. Um, the fourth business idea that you can do is jewelry store. You can sell um, earrings, necklace, bangles, nose rings, rings, waist shangas online. All you need is unique jewels, either local or imported ones. Uh, so you will not want to incur additional charges such as importation and tax. Uh, the best idea is to use the locally available jewelries. Uh, to the next one, the fifth idea will be an online fashion business. For online fashion business, you can have African attires, imported attires, or thrifted attires, which are quite cheap in Kenya. Then you have to niche down, meaning you have to concentrate in one line of fashion that you want to cons. You want to conquer your target market. Then uh, we can have men's wear, women's wear, or children's uh, wear. Uh, for women, they are, there's a wide uh, array of things that you can sell. These ladies' bags, uh, either ladies. Scratch that for ladies or women, we can categorize into three groups. Ladies, young adults, or old women. What can you sell in this category? We can have shoes, uh, sporty wear, or chunky heels, or gully, gully shoes. Then we can have dresses, um, like bodycon, black dresses, you know, and floral dresses. Then we can have trousers. Where we have palazzo pants, uh, loungewear, then jumpsuit, 
etc etc for children we, our child is between the age of 0 to 18 years but you're going to categorize this according to what you're going to sell so we can have 0 to 5 years or 0 to 3 years then there are these school going children which they start at the age between 3 to or 5 years to around 12 years or is it 13 years when they have finished their primary season then there are those who are in high school uh, with whom we call the young adults thank you for reaching at the end of this video but here is a point to take home remember to include one your number your business number that your clients or future customers can reach you um the second one is price please include your price to avoid hini pesangapi or another in english we say how much is this how much is this everybody is inquiring in your dms or in your page how much is this this means that your business is not that trustworthy it sends a wrong message to other future customers always always i emphasize on always update your page for new products thank you for coming at the end of this video see you in the next one please subscribe and comment down the business that